to Mamie Math. Today we're going to talk about how to go from fractions to decimals to percents. I'm going to take one example across the top. We have three-fourths. I'm going to change that to the decimal, 0.75, and the percent, 75. Okay, so let's go over here and look at the rules. To go from a fraction to a decimal, you're going to take the top divided by the bottom or the numerator divided by the denominator, and this is how you write it. The top or the numerator goes inside your division bar, and the bottom is on the outside, so the denominator is on the outside. Okay, to go from decimal to percent, you're going to do a little shuffle to the right. You're going to move your decimal two places to the right. And to go from percent back to fraction, you use the word percent. Per meaning division, cent meaning 100. So you're dividing by 100. So now let's go and do some examples. Okay, so we have three-fourths. Three-fourths, if I write that as a division, I'm going to put three on the inside and four on the outside, and I'm going to divide. Four does not go into three, so I add a decimal, bring it up. 4 into 30 goes 7 times, 7 times 4 is 28, subtract, bring down a 2 and of 0, 4 into 20 goes 5, so my decimal is 0.75. Now to go from decimal to percent, I'm going to move my decimal two places to the right. So I move it one between the 7 and the 5 and then behind the 5. So it's going to be 75 point, and I can put a couple zeros there, and that is my percent. Now, I'm going to do this chart, but I'm actually going to start from a decimal. So decimal to percent, I'm just going to do my two moves, one, two, so this is just 5 percent. But to go from percent back over here to the fraction, remember 5 percent means 5 per 100. So that means 5 per, which means division, 100. So it's 5 over 100. All you need to do now is reduce. So let's reduce by 5. So I divide the top and the bottom by 5, and I get 1 20th. So that is my fraction. Now let's do one more where we're going from percentage back here to fraction over to percent. If we want to move from this column to this column, instead of moving two places to the right, I can actually move two places to the left. Since there isn't a decimal, it's behind the 5, I would move it two places, so that would be 0.45. So that makes it nice and easy. And then remember, 45% means 45 per 100, so 45 per divided by 100, and I can reduce that by 5 again which gives me 9 over 20. So there is my fraction. Hope this chart is helpful.